England in white shirts kicked off against Austria at Wembley. As the visitors were beaten 4-1 recently by West Germany, this was expected to be a practice match for the mother country. And nobody was unduly alarmed when the Austrians went into the attack. A good save by Springett. Only three minutes from the start. Payne passed to Bobby Charlton. A goal. England attack again on the left. But this time, Austrian goalkeeper Fredel was in trouble. People were expecting England to run up a big score. And in the next few seconds, it was a miracle how the Austrian goal escaped. Then the attack switched to the other end. At half-time, England led 1-0, and Austria resumed with much more confidence than when the match started, though only some more poor finishing by England saved Austria hereabouts. After less than 10 minutes of the second half, Austria equalised. Inside left, Flogel scored. Right back, George Cohen tried to set his forwards an example, starting an attack. Connelly scored. England now led 2-1, but back came Austria, knowing that their fans hadn't come all this way to see them lose. Buczak's free kick bounced off Spring It and Fritz equalised. Now what price manager Alf Ramsey's World Cup hopes. Again, Fritz banged the ball into the net for the winning goal. So Austria became the third continental side ever to beat England at Wembley.